Hello, internet. <laughs> My name is Chromafish, and I'm going to be playing, I can't believe I'm saying it, Cyberpunk 2077. I am so excited. I have been waiting for this game since 2013 when that first uh, theatrical trailer released, that little teaser uh, when they didn't even know what the game was going to be. Uh, so, yeah, uh, this is one of my favorite genres. I can't wait to, to, to get in. Um, you know, I love The Witcher. Uh, I will be playing this on normal. Uh, I tried to play The Witcher 3 the first time through on hard, and that was a mistake. There was so much to that game um, that I had to, that I eventually backed myself into a corner. I had to kind of like step it down back to normal and just kind of like take that shot to the ego. Um, so I'm just gonna, I, this is the, my first time recording a game. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna mess around. I'm, I'm just gonna go to normal. And then if that's a little bit too easy, we'll step it up from there. Um, I'm probably gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and play uh, Corpo first time through. Uh, I don't think that, I suspect, uh, I'm just going with my gut here that it's gonna be one that uh, probably isn't gonna be the most popular first playthrough. Um, so just trying to make sure that you guys get, you know, uh, a little bit different, something a little bit different uh, than, the, than the other Let's Plays that are, that are inevitably going to be coming out. Uh, and other than that, the only other thing that you need to know is I'm a, I'm a very slow and deliberate player. Uh, so I'll be going through, I'll be reading anything that I can read, getting as much lore, uh, you know, really taking a look at how the game is put together. Uh, that's sort of the way that I enjoy these games the most, especially open world games. Um, it's all about exploration. It's all about like going through and f and, and soaking in the world uh, that the devs built. Um, if that's not your jam, if you're into more of a action heavy uh, playthrough, just uh, I guess you have been warmed. <laughs> um, so yeah, without any further ado, let's, uh, let's get started. Um, let's see. I don't know if this is going to be like uh, I'm hoping it's going to be controller friendly. Um, it's already given me that thing where it's a cursor controller, which is not my favorite thing, but let's see. I'd like to ask to make Cyberpunk 2027 its future expansions. I'd like your ask permission to connect and process your analytics data. Ooh. I am going to say, yeah, I, I mean, I guess I'm going to put this on the internet. So it's not like any of this is, is secret. Um, let's do it normal uh don't do that don't give me two don't give me two modes above <sighs> will be uh, combat will be a substantial challenge the effective use of perks cyberware combat gadgets and consumables will be essential to survival enemies will have all the tools at their disposal to take beyond but primarily only enemies at a higher level will prove a challenge all right i'm going hard I know what I said. If I have to step down, I will. And we're going to do Corpo. I think the stuff that we've seen in like the trailers has been a street kid. Um, and I know a nomad starts out in the country, so I'm going to do a Corpo. I'm pretty sure one of the cool things about this game is that they uh, all of these different starts, all of these different uh, build outs have completely different starting uh, uh, locations and starting backstories. I don't know how long that lasts before they sort of converge on one major quest line, but I guess I'll find out on my uh, on my next playthrough. Let's see, how do I want to start this out? What is this? Oh, this is random. <laughs> oh, this is cool. So we're playing as a corpo, and I think I'm going to try and kind of, I guess. I'm V. I'm V. I'm V. Oh, that's I'm cool. V. Let's see. Oh. Maybe I should have made a character off screen. I might cut all this out. I'm not really sure. So let's just try to burn through here as quickly as possible. So if I'm a corpo, if I'm, I've got a lot of money, you know, I'm very into like business and let's see, I guess is sort of the vibe. Very 
talk heavy, so I'd probably use a lot of hair product. But I'm not. If I'm being honest, I'm not seeing a whole, well. I'm not seeing a whole lot of hairstyles that don't use a lot of hair product. Well, this is kind of cool. I think we're gonna do that. I'm not gonna go with a man bun. Not today. It's not a man bun day. I save that for Tuesdays. I always like to go like like a like a white. That's not really a white, but that's pretty cool. This is really slick. I think I think I like this. see like sharky eyes like real dark I'm gonna go like big ol' big ol' bushy brows if I can find them <laughs> I got no brows as an option shaved them off just trying to trim up my beard went a little too high oh no we're gonna we're gonna keep those those nice and dark now I'm a guy who likes like a nice hook in the nose. That's 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 what I'm into. I think that's pretty good. That one's pretty good. There's a lot of good noses in here too. Let's do this one though. Like big, defined. I think this is my this is my guy. That looks pretty good. Let's so maybe find out if I got like a cleaner beard, because if I've got this slick of a hairstyle, you know he's he's at least, you know, if he's gonna have a long beard, he's gonna have that that hint of beard oil in it, right? Uh, I always like to play with the beard because I can't grow a proper beard myself. Uh, that's a little bit too unkempt for this guy. Hang on one second. Let's see. Oh, that's pretty good. I'm gonna do that. I think that, that that feels right to me. Oh yeah, and it lets the scar come out. That's pretty dope. So there's beard and beard style. Wait, what? Why are there two? They're just variants on the same beard. Okay. Okay. I don't think one's like a texture and the other one's like one's like the texture beard on the on the skin, the other one's like the uh actual generated hair follicles. Ooh, okay, okay. That's pretty dope. Going though, I'd like to see if they got anything in the cyberware that's like asymmetrical. I actually think because he's a corpo, he's probably gonna have to lose that scar. He's probably gonna be like super clean. Maybe this, maybe just like a little, a little glam on the eyes. I don't mind that. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. Just like like a little subtle, tasteful, tasteful touch of cyberware. Whoa, no, he definitely wouldn't have this. What is that though? So some of these are like Oh, that's off. Okay. What else we got? I think I'm gonna turn off the scars. I think scars is like a pretty, a pretty normal thing in these games. I think we get excited. Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna do tats for him. I'm RPing this guy as like super clean cut, charismatic, probably a little bit uh, too uh, I feel like this game's all about like like 
classism and everything, so he's probably, if he's a corpo, he's probably like an, a bit of an elitist. So he wouldn't dirty his skin with tattoos in the way that, like, I have. <laughs> you know? I don't know about piercings, though. Maybe, again, something subtle, something like not too much. Oh, that's a single stud. That's a smaller set of studs. I think probably this would be the most he would do. I'm gonna keep the piercing that way. Oh, teeth. Whoa. I can do like grills. Whoa. That's bananas. Probably just gonna keep it like that. Oh, and he's definitely an eye makeup kind of guy. He's a little, little posh. <laughs> he's got the smoky eye, you know? Oh, there we go. A little color on it. Oh, for sure. This is definitely it. 100%. 100%. Uh, gosh, there's so many options here. I don't know that I have time to go through all of this. Nails. That's crazy. I can change his fingernail length. A painted nail. Ooh. Maybe I go with like a chrome. Ooh, is that like a pearlescent? Jesus, I could probably just live in this editor for a while. <laughs> Gotta make sure the nips are. are whoa! Uh, gone is apparently the end of that sentence. You can just turn off the nipples. <laughs> All right. Uh, if there's nothing, oh, that's it. That's the only option. You can have nipples on or off. I'm off, because why? You know? I have nipples. They don't do much for me. <laughs> All right. Uh, probably gonna go back to off on the body scars and we are not we're just gonna keep that off and I will have to remember to edit that out <laughs> Wow it is insane like the kind of detail that you can kind of get into on this editor this is my dude uh, let's see so I've got seven points available. I've got three base stats and everything. Um, so I'm probably going to be playing him as like, uh, he's going to be a suave conversationalist. So let's jack up his cool a bit. Um, oh, okay. So six, we're, we're on a, a scale of three to six for all of this. Uh, he's probably pretty technical. Allows you... Okay, so why don't I go through and read these stats? Body determines your raw physical power. In addition to allowing you to force open doors, each level of body starting from level 3 will add 5 health points, add 3 stamina points, increase damage with fists and gorilla arms by 3 gorilla arms. Okay. Uh, increased damage with melee weapons by 1.5%, decreased movement. Okay, so standard body fair stuff. You become tougher and stronger. Uh, intelligence determine your net running proficiency. Every level of intelligence will increase cyber deck ram capacity by 4%. Increase quick hack damage by 0.5%. Increase quick hack duration by 1%. Okay. Uh, reflexes determine your maneuverability in addition to increasing your overall movement speed. Each level of reflexes will increase your passive evasion from enemy attacks by 1%, increase crit chance by 1%, increase damage from mantis blades by 3 Okay. I think probably I'm going to have high reflexes. I think, I think this guy is kind of suave. He's kind of... He's, he's suave and smart, but he's kind of a coward because he's always been sheltered, right? And the thing is, is if, if I know anything about bravery, is, is that it comes directly from the nipples. Um, and since he doesn't have nipples, he's he's having a hard time of it. You know what I mean? So so uh, they think it comes from the spine, but it doesn't. That's that's an old wives' tale. It, it comes it comes directly from the nipples. Trust me. 
So we're going to go ahead and assume that he's probably pretty quick because he runs away a lot. He's probably got okay technical ability and he's probably maybe one... Oh, I can't go down. Okay. So let me think about this. I think he's probably... Is he smarter than he is quicker? No, I think he's quicker than he is smarter. I think he's a talker, but he's not super intelligent. Which is not, not my typical... Not my typical mood uh, in these games. I usually go with uh, somebody who can unlock as many... Uh, dialogue options as I can because I really like to soak everything up but um, yeah I think that's it all right alias V backstory corpo few leave the corporate world with their lives fewer still with their souls intact you've been there you've bent the rules exploited secrets and weaponized information there's no such thing as a fair game only winners and losers yeah I think that tracks I think that tracks All right. <laughs> oh. V, you there? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm I, I assume that, uh, Airlock. Yeah, I barfed. It's just stress. Sorry about the camera. Every time I turn up the volume, it's freaking out. Don't worry, I'm not dead yet. Exactly. Yet. Anyway, what's going on? Is there a problem? We had a leak. My boss called. Dragged me in because we had to intervene. Everyone at Night City HQ is on edge. But no way you're fucked, right? You're the one who fixes other people's shit. Jackie, if you work in our soccer counter intel, you're always fucked. Uh, yeah, don't worry about me. Don't worry about me. I'll manage on my own. Buena suerte. First time in Night City, play close attention to the tutorials and learn more about the ba basic mechanics of the game. Or if you've already experienced Edge Runner, please feel free to disable hints. Go to the data database uh, at any time during the game to access tutorials. I'm going to keep the hints on for now. Um, just because I have absolutely, this is my first, obviously this is my first playthrough. Um, let's see, leave the restroom. Well, probably towards that... Uh, this guy. Gotta get used to X being the action button. Okay. Oh wow. Oh. Eliminates a terror cell in Rio de Janeiro. Doesn't seem like the uh, audio and the visuals line up here. Arasaka's counterintelligence division effectively secures a corporate summit in Jakarta, foiling 45 plots to attack and sabotage it. Sorry, I, whenever I see a uh, so, whenever I see a, a HUD marker, I instinctively go somewhere else. <laughs> Just because I want to see if there's anything, I want to see if there's anything hidden, if there's anything like what's kind of going on. I don't want to get in the habit of just following objective marker, objective marker, objective marker. It just, uh, it kind of makes you blind you to the think game. Japan will find out about what? About Frankfurt. 
I mean, it's a small leak, but still. Japan already knows. Where'd you hear this? So Japan knows everything. See, so I got I'll a jump late. button. Uh -huh. Crouch. No, not till after dinner, probably. Zoom. So look, this is because I don't have any eye enhancements. This is the. Uh, this is just. I'm squinting really hard. You know what I mean? It's like you walk out and you try to see something off in the distance. You're like, uh. Uh, yeah, I think that's my head cannon at least. Classic sprint. Okay, nothing really going on in here. Ooh. Ooh. See, this is this is why this is why I look around. I feel like this is foreshadowing. I'm gonna have to fight one of these things. All right. My curiosity is satisfied. Let me just sprint through this lobby. demonstrated the work ethic and natural talent becoming of an exceptional manager. That is, until his promising career was abruptly interrupted okay. by Bora. Militech hit three of ours. Now we're evacuating the rest of ours. Mr. Jenkins asked for you. He's in his office. All right. Hey, V. It's been ages. Emergency protocols active. System security confirmed. I see you're busy. We'll talk later. Make sure that stuff is oh, I, oh, I missed it. I that missed the rude, opportunity. But okay, where were we? Oh, there we go. I thought I missed the opportunity. Uh, I remember you. I didn't know you were in Night City. How have you been? Uh, you know how it is. A week ago, I was still in Cape Town. I heard you're in Counter Intel. Must have a shit show on your hands right now, Frankfurt. Jenkins is your lead, right? Is he what everyone says he is? Uh, what are people What's saying about him? Say about Jenkins. That he's effective, like any psychopath. <laughs> Apparently, he's gone a little crazier lately. Hey, he's in a tough spot. The director was supposed to greenlight his promotion when the Japanese arrived. She stabbed him in the back instead. Uh, who do you? Uh, tell me about Cape Town. Tell me about the op in Cape Town. Operation Cargo. You know about it? Arming local conflicts in Africa. I didn't know that was you. It was me. We dumped crates full of rifles into the ocean. They had to be pulled out using borrowed fishing boats. Mm -hmm. Same old circus, but hey, that's how wars are won. Who do you work under? And you, who do you work under? Abernathy. She's really good. Came up with the whole Cape Town ploy on her own. Abernathy. The bitch who burned my boss in the promotion to Spec Ops Director. You know how it is. Things happen. Yeah. They do indeed. Alright, so I'm apparently pretty loyal to my boss. Listen, sorry. Uh, in a bit of a rush right now. We'll talk another time, okay? Sure, sure. Good seeing you again. I just noticed I have a stock ticker there on the bottom, bottom right of the screen. Uh, which is pretty dope. We're pulling people out of Prague. Yeah, because of Frankfurt. Okay, so Frankfurt is something that is a big deal. They're like, oh, Frankfurt blew up. Uh, there was a, I'm guessing there were, it Please seems like there was a leak or something. Uh, I'm not sure. I, I'm guessing we're going to learn more about it. What is happening? Visitor authorization granted. Are you online? Okay. Have a seat, B. Be right with you. 
Um, we have to handle this voting issue before we lose our bases in the sea of clouds. They're about to begin. What's the situation? Hmm. Just looking around. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just as we thought. Boom. Uh, read. Let's see. Mare Nubium. Uh, L-A-T. I don't know what that stands for. Sea of Clouds. Lunar, lunar mare on the near side of the moon. Diameter 444 miles. Selenographic boundaries. Uh, and then we got some coordinates. Uh, economic significance. Negligible. Composed primarily of research facilities, serving as cover for more complex operations. Tactical significance, high. Mare Nubium is a basin of black clinics essential for research into innovative and experimental technologies. Logistical significance, moderate. Located in relative close proximity to Oceanus Pros, Pros, what, Prosolarum? Prosolarum? I don't know. Uh, the location of the Western Mass driver okay anything else have a seat please. be right with you I heard you the first time uh, I've got I've got things to do don't worry I've got my own got my own timetable here you know what to do start now oh you waited to start until I sat down that's great oh that's messed up don't do that this is this the guy I like? Director Abernathy. I watched the vote. What the hell was that? A deep clean after the shit Frankfurt dumped on us. As we agreed, I got rid of the problem. I told you to resolve the problem, not massacre the European Space Council. Do you understand what the cover-up will cost? We would have lost the license. Now we gained a week. That's a win. Path of least resistance always. No nuance has you written all over it. We're not done talking about this. In trouble. But you did just like kill a room full of people. Bitch. I always have. Uh, well, this isn't the first time Abernathy set you up. I don't know about no, that. Not the first. Smeared me in front of Japanese execs. So she'd be the one promoted to director of spec ops. I guess we're done sitting. That's fine. Now she's holding a gun to my head to make sure I don't try anything. But she won't pull the trigger because she needs. I notice that's just one glass. I do what she doesn't have the guts to do. One. Divide and conquer. Effective strategy. <laughs> Effective. What would you do in my position? Uh, I don't like this guy. I know my character does, so I guess he's going to say you, you need to, to defend, defend yourself. yourself. Remind Abernathy you're not her doorman. You're right. Smack her once, but hard. She'll respect you. Seems we see eye to eye on this issue. Whoa. What was that? Something glitched out there. Uh, oh, he said take this. I must have accidentally skipped it. Go on. Take it. The data, data shard? shard? Proof of my trust. Go on. Take it. <laughs> Don't. Are you peer pressuring me into taking this? Alright. It's what I've collected over the past weeks. Susan Abernathy. Trauma team card. Names yeah. of her closest associates. Oh, wow. Chief of security. Lover. Lover's husband. Incredible Never. that you're saying those Use things it. as they're popping make up on sure my HUD. Abernathy won't be a problem anymore. You said it. I need to defend myself. Yeah. If anyone finds out we even talked about this, I'll go down with you. That's true. But everyone knows you only made it to where you are, thanks to me. So it's not like they could ever believe you played no part in it. And if I refuse? What'll happen if I refuse? Don't ask stupid questions. This isn't a request, V. We seem to understand each other. Take this, too. 
Hey. Can't go wrong with the cash. Credit ship transactions are traceable. Paper disappears as soon as you spend it. What can I say? Use this money only. Find the right people for the job. No corporate affiliation. And for the core task, use someone you know inside out. Hmm. Are we clear? Yeah, I think we're clear. Good. In that case, I'll await your report. And good luck with it. Sure. I have my AV waiting outside. It's yours to use. And don't disappoint me. All right. Jenkins, so I guess. Night City Counter Intel. So I guess I'm doing uh, doing some work for for my boss. Going for that. I'm shooting for that corner office promotion. You know. Uh, get a little get a little bump, bump in responsibilities. Get my own department. Is this is this tracking? <laughs> you know, I'll file so many reports. Oh, I thought they it was going to scan me you for? Uh, You're late. They were supposed to be ready yesterday. I, I know, but I, I have them now. I don't want to send them away. Send I want them to the... my inbox, and you and I will have a word about this later. That's right. That's because I... Hey, V, you alive? Strict, strict the leader. No leeway, right? Uh, Need your help. Need your help, Jack. Got some biz. I like that jacket. <sighs> Always biz with you, Mano. You in some trouble? Not yet. Right now, I just need a soul I can trust. That kind of sounded like a yes. Meet me at Lizzie's. Be there in an hour. Let's see. The, the Valar mission. Back to square one. The failure of the Valar mission, which undermines the progress of the Lyseral 3.0 programmers are understanding of exoplanet group may be definitive proof that the current space race is hindering overall space exploration efforts rather than fueling them through noble competition. In 2060, Lagaretto predicted that the pace of technological development at the time would lead to the confirmation of the existence of white holes and the discovery of a theory of quantum gravity within 15 years. Alas, those 15 years have come and gone. Perhaps if the ESA, SRC, and Orbital Air tried to cooperate and share information in the spirit of science for a change, rather than torpedoing each other's research, the situation today might be very different. All right. Oh. Ooh, is this my, this is my cubicle. Oh, that's my workmate. I need your stamp on something. It's possible one of our assets was exposed. Uh, is this about Frankfurt? Is it Frankfurt again? No, different issue. Local. Oh. Tell me. Quick version. Our agent at Biotechnica suspects they might be on to him. They recently granted him red security clearance. That's Tom. He's been fishing for dirt, but it's been slow. Your point. <laughs> is he a day They're trader? They're clean. Like we run orphanages clean. Bleach server clean. Oh. We suspect they flagged him and are feeding him phony data. Should we green light Xfil or let him keep looking? Mm. What are the risks? Projected risks? Limited threat to life, not biotechnica style. Blackmail's possible, leveraged against false accusations in the media. The guy has kids, he'd crack. Mm. Let's keep him digging. Keep him there digging. We invested way too much getting him that deep to back out now. Yeah. You sure? Do I really need to repeat myself? Oh, of course not. No way that's going to have consequences. All right. I guess time to time to execute some trades. Oh, I forgot about my nails. So dope. Uh, open drawer. Let's see. Pick up card. What's this for? Uh, okay. I don't know if that like adds something to me. Now I'm more smarter. I can think good. Uh, let's use the computer. Messages. All right, vacation with the stars. The Crystal Palace unbeatable offers. Have you been to... Oh, this seems like spam. Uh, have you been to Thailand, Morocco, and Alaska more times than you can count? 
Looking for an adventure that isn't just another tour around Europe? Do you want to see how the world's biggest film and brain dance stars relax and party? Do you want to see the stars among the stars? Now you can! The Crystal Palace is offering a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to book an Earthview apartment along with a cosmically gargantuan selection of vouchers for any of our award-winning restaurants and casino comps to get Lady Luck on your side early. And don't worry, we do everything to assure your stay is heavenly, but your bill isn't astronomical. That sounds like a good deal. Your biodata indicators are reading abnormally. High levels of cortisol, uh, cata catecholamine, and adrenaline per persist from previous results, so it sounds like I'm stressed. Hormone blockers usage is prescribed for only two weeks before requiring a baseline reset, but your usage has continued beyond three weeks. Recommendation, meet with your trainer to prepare a recovery plan. <laughs> so the plan is to make a plan. Got it. Postmortem, Operation Wormy Apple. <laughs> Love it. Uh, from the Arasaka Department of Analytics, Night City. Uh, the meeting of the Department of Operational Oversight Committee fi finds as follow regarding Operation Wormy Apple. The operation was executed without following proper procedure, ju procedure just putting agent, thus putting agent lives and more importantly company reputation in jeopardy. The operation's success is due solely to the fact that Petrochem committed errors which proved more costly than our own. All personnel involved planning the operation will be subject to internal audit. We, file, we find the death of the Prague contract use uh, caused toxin-induced cardiac arrest a direct result of poor planning, and required action is to investigate all stages of operation planning from reconnaissance to implementation with the aim of isolating irregularities in procedure and or judgment. Uh, we are pleased to announce the opening of a new space in our... I thought I was going to get a... Re oh, is this the report that I was supposed to have? then or I thought I was supposed to get a report from that guy is that here in files ah here it is yeah after ac assessing data collected from contact reports in Utah Nevada Arizona and Montana we did not confirm any active Noosa efforts against Arasaka assets which I think Arasaka is the company I work for uh, or operations in the federal territories however the same conclusion cannot be drawn regarding potential threats from Militech Although the corporation has obvious close ties from the Noosa government, we were unable to obtain valuable intel to much higher control and internal procedure and information flows. We must rely on unconfirmed circumstantial evidence obtained by our own field agents for the time being. Conclusion, further human gathering required. Current data are circumstantial and do not allow indisputable conclusions. Okay. That's fine. What is this here? Looking for a career change? Join Netwatch. Tracking down Netrunner running. Gosh, there's just so much reading. I don't know if I can actually, I don't know if I can keep going at this pace. Uh, it's a lot of reading. <laughs> Tracking down Netrunner Renegades, uh, combating demons, rebuild. I mean, I love it. Uh, rebuilding the American net. These are just some of the daily tasks entrusted to the special agents in Netwatch. If you'd rather lose your eyes than your deck, if an encounter with a Mephistopheles is just another walk in the park for you, then maybe it's time you joined our team. Here's what you can expect to contribute as a Netwatch agent. Uh, patrolling all public access to the net, uh, tracking and eradicating illegal Netrunner activity, hunting down dangerous... So this is like a white hat hacker, is what this is. Uh, thanks to, uh, that's what it seems like, uh, but in the cyberpunk world. Thanks to Netwatch, thousands of people can freely use approved search engines and other net services without fear of falling victim to nefarious de uh, demon threats. 24 hours a day, 365 days a year, we serve tirelessly to eliminate corrupted data forts, safeguard our information, and arrest dangerous cyber criminals. Do you have what it takes? Apply today. So something I love in these uh, like world building heavy games is how I just love the fact that there's so many like advertisements for fake things and that might be all that happens like there might be an advertisement for say that uh, vacation company and that might be the last we hear of it or we might spot it somewhere else in the wild. 
Um, and for some reason, I just really, I really love that. I really love kind of like being in the world and just pretending for a while that it's, that it's real. Um, especially when it's like, especially when it's like, I got a sci-fi background, which obviously this does very much. Oh, dope. Is this my car? my head around real quick just to see what else we got going on but here's another car it looks the same and here's another car oh these are company vehicles that's why they look the same they have arasaka written right on them and i'm guessing this is our, our little three node logo little three node tech tree this is nice though this is this is this is classy please provide your destination Bring up districts and analytics first. Oh. Bring up district analytics. Increased NCPD presence Get a little and activity has been reported. Business class drunk. No official statement has been forthcoming. Intercepted radio communications suggest MaxTac has been sent to the area. A widespread power failure has been reported in Santo Domingo. All other districts exhibit activity within expected parameters. Well, let's go to the bar. Destination, Lizzie's Bar. I'll do a little pre-gaming and then... Ah, uh, I should have watched the news. I don't know if it's going to give me the option now. Oh, yes. Perfect. This is N54 News broadcasting with a breaking story for you. A conference of the European Space Council screeched to a grisly halt. Jesus. <laughs> I was expecting system. him to take a sip. Five European Space <laughs> Council members are dead, while three oh. remain in critical condition. Authorities are still looking into what might have caused this shocking incident. The council members were all wearing Biotechnica-provided devices. The corporation's representatives have, as yet, refused to comment. Our reporter is on the scene. We'll have updates on developments as they come to light. Stay with M54 News for the latest. The scope is really, really big. Life coach. Hello, V. It yes. seems like it's giving me the we option schedule to answer, the connect till the end of the week. but it just answers on its own. Quantified Satori received notification of a somewhat troubling biometric reading. I felt I should call. Is everything in order? Honestly, things are only alright. I'm dealing with a temporary nuisance. Nothing you should worry about. Just think back to our last session. The neuromotor relaxation exercises three times a day They'll soothe and lift your spirit. I know this. Sure, okay. See you later. Well, that's nice. So this is pretty cool. I think I was I think I was hoping that uh I don't know. I'm excited to get out into the city and like like walk around it. Cause from the window here, it doesn't feel like you're necessarily outside, but I think no like. No designated landing site has been detected at the destination. That a problem? Find a spot close to the bar, as close as you can. Fuck procedures. That's the spirit. Initiating landing sequence based on new parameters. <laughs> based on new parameters. Fucking procedures. Uh, but yeah, it doesn't feel like it. Feel it has that kind of quality where it feels like you're in a big studio. But I think that'll go away once we're like in the daytime. Um, oh man, I'm so excited. We have arrived at your destination. Fuck's your problem, Psycho Sue. This looked like a landing pad to you. Could have fucking crushed us. Out of my way. What? I had the option Who to attack the there. Who the fuck are you to say not. that to me? Because our soccer counter I'm intel. We done here? That's right. Oh, those are some gold pants. Used to be a hood disc. Corporals. Fucking do whatever. Think the world's theirs. Oh, buddy. Let's see. 
couldn't use the front door like everyone else? No. If everyone else is using the front door, then why is there a bouncer out here? Uh... What oh. the f Keep an eye on the AV for me, will you? <laughs> I don't get paid to do that. I wasn't asking. I'm not a scratch on it when I get back. Welcome to Lizzie's. You should not have been that nice to me. I was not very nice to you. Uh, I can go in there. What's over here, though? Ooh. I have a tiger, babe. Yep, love that song. I have a tiger. It's the da 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 da. No future. Wait. I was just checking. <laughs> okay. What is that? Is there something blue in the wall there? Oh, I can't get it. Whatever it is. Don't touch me. Sorry. This. I don't know if you can hear it. I don't know if it's gonna come through the way that it's coming through for me, but it's the sounds like dope. Oh, there's I saw I see Jack down there. Let's go back to my booze. Jackie, I get a drink. Looking for your June. Already here. Dapping his fingers. Wait for him. This is the century. This is the century. Okay. He knew exactly where I was here to see. No, come here often, do ya? <laughs> it's good to see you, Cabron. Now sit down and tell me what's got your shorts in a knot. It's good to see you too, Jack. How you been? I got sparks flying between the Valentino boys and male I like Jackie's jacket. Eddie's there for the taking. As long as you don't get flatlined. Yeah, I know how it is. Can't complain, but we ain't here to shoot the shit about me. Let me hear about this problem of yours. This needs to stay between us. Jackie, before I start, this stays between us. Por supuesto. I'm serious. This thing, it could ruin me. So could I. You do realize who you're talking to, right? The guy who's done this before. Mm. Remember what happened in Mexico, at the border? I keep one word. I know, you saved my ass. I've worried about the cartels that gotten out. But it didn't. And this won't either. That's why you came to see dear old Jackie. That's true. Data shard. Take it. What do you think? Won't come cheap. It'll have to be done on the sly. No trail. Hard eddies only. Got the money. Full crew job for sure. Techie. Maybe two. A runner with a gold-plated brain. And a driver with wheels from hell. Not to mention a solo. Hmm. Piece I'm missing. That what you need from me? My trigger finger to zero this lady? Uh, I need someone I can trust. Delicate situation, I know. That's why I need somebody I can trust. This ain't no delicate situation, hermano. It's a hit job, plain and simple. You know how Arasaka operates. Okay, maybe you don't. This isn't a professional request I can refuse. But I can. And I am. And you should too. Oh. Now, what do you say we liquor up and talk life? Gracias, mamita. Double tequila with grenadine and lime. 
Nothing better for drowning nerves. To this. Was that a toast? What the hell does that even mean? You raise a glass to your mama, your hermana. To the mamacita <laughs> you'll meet at the bar. But this doesn't say a damn thing. To this. This job and all the rest of that corpo bullshit. Oh, I got a little drunk going on. Probably the drink I had in the bar or in the car. Been saying it all along. Soldier, soldier, those are Rizaka fuckers. Today, they got you to zero somebody. Tomorrow, they'll get somebody else to zero you. I think I have a choice. If I refuse, they take everything and leave me nothing. Yeah, well, let them. They'll also take the fist they got gripping your balls. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty picky about who I let touch my balls. And Saburo and his matones, oh, they definitely do not make the cut. Maybe someday, but for now, I'm still well within their reach. You'll always be within reach. Always with me. Hey, you lost? What? Got a problem? What's going on v. here? Is that right? Uh, you're from headquarters. You're from Arasaka HQ. Is there a problem? Are you here about Frankfurt? We're here for you. What did I do? Jenkins assigned you a task today. So I'll share some all the details That's okay. with us. Uh, who are you again? Name and department again? Didn't quite catch it first time around. Gah, fuck! How you feeling? Pretty sharp dive, huh? Your access to company networks is hereby revoked. Am I getting fired? In two minutes, any company cybernetics in your possession will cease functioning. What? Give us the data you received from Jenkins. This will conclude termination procedures. Why did I get... Why did I get fired? How the hell did you find out? That is not your concern. The data, now. Uh... Oh, I don't have an option but to surrender it? What if I just don't? I'm just gonna live in this moment. Jackie's just chilling out. That's fine. Information's on the short. Smart choice. I lost my job. <sighs> we done. With the formalities? Yes. But I think Abernathy would gladly up our fee for ridding her of a piece of rot like you. Stand up. You're coming with us. Come on, move Fire it. Fire spinning. I think you fellas might have forgotten just how far from home you are. I'm not sure this body was your style, let alone a healthy option. Get out of Is that a threat? Well, you start shooting, maybe we join in, huh? Before you know it, somebody might die today. Oh, Jack, you are the man. For. We can do for now. <laughs> Big brother. Big brother Jackie. Ooh, one there. V, how you feel? You all right? I, I can't. I, I can't breathe. Need help? No, no, it's just withdrawal syndrome, sort of. I think they cut off my hormone regulators. Oh shit. Biomon and SAT analysis system. Body's gotta adjust. Hey. Hey. Should I get you to a ripper? Or I guess maybe trauma team's on its way. Uh just need to catch my breath. Give but me a positive minute. about it. Get my shit together. That that would be that, Jack. Just lost control of my life. Completely. So I guess the job's off. I'd say you got it back. You couldn't say no to him. So they said it to you. This is a turn for the better. You'll see. I wasn't expecting Besides, that. You haven't lost everything. Still have a friend? I'm about to say I, I still have a friend? That's sweet. <laughs> no, dumbass. You still got that wad for the hit job, don't you? Probably oh. some fat-ass chunk of cha-chain. Just right for a new start. 
That's right, fool. Buckle up. Oh, Jackie's the best. Hey, you hearing all right? Don't look so hot. V! V! Hey, hermano. Uh, Your new life. It starts now. Apparently one of the, uh, one of the, uh, uh, Corpo implants it was in my inner ear because he was struggling. Stanley here with you, and we got another. There we go. This is what I was hoping for. Ooh, I love this town. Love it like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps like of a bridge once, and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her. Every new day here means a hundred new arrivals, but only half these gonks will survive a year, and that's if it's a good one. And why do these peeps come to NC? Well, to be street samurai like Morgan, Blackhand, and Waylon Boa Boa. The greater the risk, the more I gotcha. the more kids. Or so they say. But you can only be a major league player for so long. The faster you live, the faster you burn out. If you don't get a bullet to the brain first. <laughs> so the origin story, I think, was basically that. That was my corpo background. And I'm betting you this is where they all kind of converge. Because it looks like I'm running jobs with Jackie and doing a bunch more stuff with them. So I think that's probably where I'm going to stop for now. Uh, but yeah, I'm man, I'm super excited to uh, to keep playing this. Uh, yeah, I'll try to uh, I'll try to release another another video tomorrow. Um, and we will. Uh, We'll continue we'll continue from there. Yeah, see you next time.